St. Paul tells us in Ephesians chapter 6. Slaves, obey your earthly masters with respect and fear and with sincerity of heart, just as you would obey Christ. Obey them not only to win their favor when their eye is on you, but like slaves of Christ, doing the will of God from your heart. Serve wholeheartedly as if you were serving the Lord, not men, because you know that the Lord will reward everyone for whatever good he does, whether he is slave or free. These words are craziness to us. St. Paul is teaching us not to concern yourself with who your boss is, even when you're a slave, as is the context here, but to consider yourself as working for the Lord. Consider and look at yourself as a slave of Christ, so that you are trying to do the good thing, the right thing, because that is what he calls you to do. He has made you new. He has taken you and washed you and cleaned you in baptism, making his blood cover you and all your sin. And now he calls you to this new life in the spirit, this new worship life. And guess what? It looks very different than the way the world works. It's even how a slave can continue under a master that might be very hard with them, that might mistreat them, and still sees their true master as Jesus. And so serves that other master, the earthly master, in all the ways Paul says.